Good morning, everyone. I hope everyone's had a good morning so far. It is Saturday morning uh, at 12.17. Well, I guess afternoon now. Uh, it's 12.17 p.m. Uh, so today is going to be a quick tutorial on how to use and well how to download and use TeamSpeak 3. A uh, quick rundown on what the server or TeamSpeak 3 is. Basically, it's a voice chat program, similar to Skype, just no video, but it uses a lot less power. Uh, in terms of CPU power, it uses a lot less power to run than what Skype does. So it makes it great for people playing games who are talking with their friends. Uh, to go ahead and download it, you go to www.teamspeak.com forward slash downloads. And I'll put the link to this in the description. Uh, you'll come to this page. Make sure you're on the client tab. Uh, this is the server tab that you don't have to worry about. But um, the client tab here, there's going to be versions for Windows 32 and 64 bit, OS X, and Linux 32 and 64 bit. You will want to download the appropriate client for your operating system, whether it's 32 or 64 bit. Click download. You'll download it into your browser downloads folder, and then what you'll do is you'll install it um, somewhere, and you'll probably have a shortcut on your desktop. Um, you can put that shortcut wherever you feel is um, useful for you. But anyways, um, so what I'll do is I'll just close that out there again and um, open it up. Uh, when you get this, um, once you open the op the client. You'll have this window that comes up. And what you're going to do is you can go to connections, and the server IP for my Teamspeak server is ts84.gameservers.com colon nine one zero three, and I'll put that in the description as well. But you have to have the Teamspeak client to get onto the Teamspeak server. So go ahead and connect. Connected. Microphone and muted. what you do, well, when you connect, you're going to be in the lobby. Um, and most people, well, people playing the, on the server are going to be in the Minecraft channel right here. Uh, you double click this to join it. I'm not going to do that now just because uh, people are in there. Um, but this is the microphone mute microphone button. Microphone activated. Microphone um, muted. So you can use that to mute your microphone. Sound you muted. can mute your audio. Sound resume. Unmute it. This is the away soon. button to tell people that you aren't currently at your computer Welcome back. and there's lots of different um, options in here you can get more into that later but uh, if you're gonna be talking in TeamSpeak you are required to use push to talk it's just so that people don't talk over each other don't um, hold open their microphones when people are talking all that stuff it's just uh, troll prevention um, and if not saying that anyone's going to do that, but pro people probably will. Just make sure that you use push to talk so that you don't cause trouble. Otherwise, there's going to be trouble. <laughs> um, but anyways, um, set push to talk. You set your uh, key that you hold down. Basically, when you want to talk, you have to press and hold that button while you're talking, and then you release it. Um, obviously, I'm just using voice activation detection. Um, from streaming but um, anyways oh one more thing if you want to um, bookmark the server like if you're going to be on multiple TeamSpeak servers uh, feel free to add bookmark and then you can type in the title you want for it for the name and then you type in your IP and uh, just make sure you set um, for the nickname uh, just set it to your in-game name, which is usually the easiest for people to see who you are in TeamSpeak and who you are on the server. Um, and the server is going to be public soon. I'm just I have to do plugins today, but um, anyways, guys, I hope that helped out. If you have any further questions, feel free to leave a comment below the video, or um, if I'm stream if I happen to be streaming, um, feel free to ask in chat. Otherwise, um, this should help you get on the TeamSpeak server and be able to play Minecraft with us. So I want to thank you for watching my tutorial. And if you have any other tutorials you would like me to make, if you have a question about something, you want a tutorial to do it for it, uh, feel free to ask. 
and I will make one for you. So anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you later.